Louisiana Living. And welcome back. The second annual NELA Teacher Symposium is this Thursday and Friday, July 11th and 12th at Tower Place in Monroe. And the symposium will feature a number of renowned speakers and presenters, four of which are joining us today on Louisiana Living. And for this first segment, I'd like to introduce Angel Parisi, who is next to me. She's a mentor and founder of Strong Me Ministries and Angel in the House Music. And Sheila Jones, life coach and founder of the Green Pepper Project and and wicked results. Thank you so much for joining us. It's great to have you both. Thank you. Uh, Sheila, I'm going to start with you. How did you become involved in the teacher symposium? And most of all, why did you say yes? Oh, it's a great story. Uh, I was certified through Center for Teacher Effectiveness on Time to Teach, and a couple of us crossed paths with Faith, and she recruited us. And when I heard her message about the symposium. It was inspiring. It was inspirational. Mm -hmm. She was so passionate. She and is. I just could not, I, I couldn't say yes fast enough. <laughs> That's awesome. And where are you from? I'm from Lancaster, Pennsylvania. Well, welcome to Northeast Louisiana. And uh, Angel, where are you from? Well, I have two homes, North Texas and Southern California. Okay. Well, welcome to Northeast <laughs> Louisiana. You. After you. you left the classroom, what inspired you to motivate teachers to love teaching again? Well, I also uh, was trained, well, I retired from the classroom actually in June of 22. Uh -huh. So it's just been recent and um, I taught for 23 years elementary and I didn't know exactly what I was going to do. But then I heard about the opportunity to be trained and certified with uh, Time to Teach, certified uh, Center for Teacher Effectiveness. Uh -huh. And so I uh, thought that would be a great way for me to carry on what I did in the classroom to help others do the same thing. Wonderful. And Sheila, for the teachers who registered for the symposium and the community participants, there were some questions about what was important to them. And one of the components was mental health and wellness. Why do you think that that is a growing concern? I think it's a, a very growing topic at this point. There's been a lot of impact from the pandemic that we're still recovering from. I think the teachers have a lot of things on their plates between trying to manage the students, trying to manage the parents, trying to manage the curriculum, and all of the things that are connected to it. And I feel like there's a lot of pressure coming to them from all sides, mm -hmm. and it's hard to balance. So I think it's really a, a very big topic, mental mm -hmm. health and being able to balance everything. It was one of the main topics of uh, concern among yeah. the participants. Yes. We're yes. out of time for this segment, but it is so nice to meet you, and I wish you much success at the thank symposium, you. and thank you for visiting us here on Louisiana Living. Thank and you. we're going to also be joined by two more presenters, incredible speakers here on Louisiana Living. That will be after the break, so stay with us.